Welcome to Byte Further. Today, we're going to talk about how to fix iPhone 15 touchscreen not working. We'll list some common unresponsive touchscreen issues first, tell you what render iPhone 15 touchscreen not responding to touch, and finally show you several solutions to fix the issue. Let's start. Here are some general scenarios when the touchscreen stops working. 1. You wake up in the morning and the device's touch screen was unresponsive and won't let you unlock or respond to touch or swipe. 2. iPhone 15 touch screen is not working after updating the device to iOS 17. 3. While you're using the device, like texting on the virtual keyboard, iPhone 15 touch screen doesn't work all of a sudden. It won't restart at all after pressing the buttons. 4. You find iPhone 15 touch screen not working properly when charging. Okay. Now, you might be wonder why the screen doesn't respond or let you touch anything. The possible reasons include the dirty display, disordered system, incompatible peripherals, old iPhone operating system, unknown software error, and phone damage. Targeting at these possible culprits, we'll show you how to fix iPhone 15 unresponsive touch screen using the corresponding solutions. Just follow them one by one or you can use the timestamp to quickly locate the method. 1. Free the screen off dirt, screen protector and phone case. The step is to eliminate the cause of dirt or obstacles that could make your iPhone 15 touch screen not to respond at all. All you need to do is to take off the screen protector and phone case first if any. Then, use the soft and dry cloth to wipe clean the touch screen back and forth. Next, touch the screen and see if your iPhone 15 responds to the touch right now. 2. Remove cables, chargers and headphones. The step is to eliminate the cause of incompatible accessories. Remove or disconnect any peripherals you may have connected to your iPhone 15. For example, the lightning cables, chargers, headphones and so on. Then, see if your iPhone 15 touch screen works properly right now. 3. Unfreeze the unresponsive iPhone 15 screen with a force restart. The step is to eliminate the cause of disordered operating system. It'll force turn off your iPhone, let the system refresh and then turn it back on. The steps are the same for an iPhone 15, iPhone 15 Plus, iPhone 15 Pro, and iPhone 15 Pro Max. Quickly press the volume up button then release. Quickly press the volume down button then release. Then press the side button and hold it for around 10 seconds. Your phone will shut down first, and later the Apple logo pops up on the screen. Just let go of the side button and wait for it to turn on. If this iPhone 15 screen not responding to touch fix helps solve your problems, you should check out if you've recently downloaded unsafe apps or the storage space is small. 4. Update your iPhone 15 system using a computer. The step is to eliminate the cause of old iOS firmware installed in your iPhone 15. Running an outdated operating system may lead to touch screen not working on iPhone 15 at all. All you need to do is to update the system using a computer so that you don't have to gain the access to the phone settings app. The steps are the same for an iPhone 15, iPhone 15 Plus, iPhone 15 Pro, and iPhone 15 Pro Max. Use an Apple MFI certified cable to attach the device to a computer. Then, download, install and open iTunes, Apple devices or Finder software. Next, let your iPhone 15 go into recovery mode. Quickly press the volume up button then release. Quickly press the volume down button then release. Press the power button and keep holding it for a few seconds keep holding the power button even when you see the Apple logo screen. When you see a computer, a USB cable, and a link showing up on a black screen, release the power button. It's a recovery mode screen. Now, go back to the computer. A message dialog box should have popped up iTunes, Apple devices or Finder window. It'll give you two buttons, update and restore. Click the update button. There are still some steps in the following. Just do what it asks you to do unless you see it starts downloading the latest iOS software. You can see the download icon on the top right corner is active and circling. Wait and you can click the download icon to see the status of the procedure. In the end, you should turn on iPhone 15 and its touchscreen works normally. 5. Factory reset your iPhone 15 using a computer. The step is to eliminate the cause of unknown software error. 
This step will erase all your data and restore your phone back to its factory default settings to clear out the unknown errors resulting in an unresponsive touch screen on your iPhone 15. Make sure to back up your phone before completing this step. That way you won't lose any personal information such as photos, videos, and texts. The steps are the same for an iPhone 15, iPhone 15 Plus, iPhone 15 Pro, and iPhone 15 Pro Max. Use a cable to attach the device to a computer. Then, download, install and open iTunes, Apple devices or Finder software. Next, let your iPhone 15 go into recovery mode. Quickly press the volume up button then release. Quickly press the volume down button then release. Press the power button and keep holding it for a few seconds. Keep holding the power button even when you see the Apple logo screen. When you see a computer, a USB cable, and a link showing up on a black screen, release the power button. It's a recovery mode screen. Now, go back to the computer. In the opening dialog box, click the restore button. There are still some steps in the following. Just do what it asks you to do unless you see it starts downloading the latest iOS software and restoring your iPhone 15 back to its factory settings. Wait until your iPhone 15 boots up and shows the hello screen. 6. Repair your iPhone 15 in an Apple repair store. The step is to eliminate the cause of phone damage. All you need to do is to book an appointment at the Apple Repair Store or Apple Authorized Repair Provider near you and bring your phone there to check out the touch screen and other hardware components. That's all how to fix an iPhone 15 touch screen not working. Hope this video can help make it respond to touch, tap and swipe. If it does, please give it a thumbs up and share it via Facebook, Twitter, and so on to help others in need. Also, if you have any further questions, Feel free to write them down in the comments below and I'll reply ASAP. To learn more tech tips about iPhones, subscribe to the Byte Further channel. Now, you can click another video on the screen to keep watching.